Gross domestic product fell at a 1% annualized rate, worse than the most pessimistic forecast in a Bloomberg survey of economists. Revised Commerce Department figures showed today in Washington. George Ramos of Univision is upset and said, Reporters are cozy with power, they act like they're in a club. I couldn't agree more with that statement. Confidence in Veterans Affairs Secretary Eric Shinseki disintegrated further Thursday on Capitol Hill, where a rising chorus of lawmakers in both parties said he should resign and let new leadership address systemic problems at VA medical centers. A House committee moved forward with the measure Thursday to scale back school lunch standards, despite high-profile opposition from First Lady Michelle Obama. Pacers take advantage of LeBron James' foul trouble to stave off elimination with 93-90 win over Heat. Saad sets up Hansis in second overtime, as the Blackhawks beat Kings 5-4, in Game 5 to still stay alive in the playoffs. Brad Pitt was signing autographs outside the El Capitan Theater, while Pitt was signing, someone jumped over a metal barrier and took a swing at Brad, striking him in the face. The alleged assailant, whom the police identified as Vitaly Sidyak, 25, was led away in handcuffs, 